I am Crystal Simon and I am the CEO at care to learn Our mission is to come, along, come alongside school districts to help meet their students' health, hunger, hygiene needs. We started right here in Springfield and fast forward to today, we partner with 41 school districts across the state. Uh, things that you and I take for granted every single day, uh, providing those opportunities, that I believe is like my true heart and what I desire to do. Looking back, when I was probably in high school, I am a Kickapoo alum. I've always wanted to do nonprofit and service work, um, but going out of college, I was in a for-profit or uh, business um, industry, and I enjoyed it, but I didn't feel like it was my true passion. I spent um, almost six years at Camp Barnabas, which is a Christian summer camp, and I got to um, be the COO uh, for four years, and then I did development prior to that for them. I love the opportunity to use what I believe is like my gifting and um, what I really, I feel like I'm good at uh, with like my passion and purpose that ultimately I hope is going to make a life-changing impact. Is a lot of times it's that counselor, it's that nurse, it's the teacher, it's the bus driver. Um, a lot of times that teacher or that counselor who has that relationship with that student comes alongside and provides support. So it could be eyeglasses, it could be shoes, it could be access to clean clothing, it could be additional clothing, um, it could be that um, they need to go to the doctor or they need some sort of assistance. Um, that's where kind of Care to Learn steps in. And so what I love about that is not only do I help the student, but I hopefully help that educator. And we empower them to where they're not spending their own dollars and they're not having to come up with solutions on the fly that I hope allows them to enjoy the job that they, you know, they felt like that they were called to do that I hope makes their job easier. You know, right now we are doing some really cool hygiene drives and um, depending upon what product we're running low on, we have the opportunity uh, for uh, companies or civic groups or church groups to essentially fill a box and donate it back to care to learn and then we will get it to students. And I say all the time, you were either the kid that was struggling and you didn't have your needs met um, or your neighbor was. So you knew the friend that rode the bus next to you, um, that it was obvious that his parents didn't have the same resources that you had. What we have actually next door is we have a clothing closet project through Springfield Public Schools, which means that we have brand new product as well as hygiene and snack foods available in the 47 of the 52 SPS buildings. So we try to buy in bulk from corporate vendors that will give us better pricing uh, to where that we can stretch that dollar even more. We do a Shop with a Hero event. It's kind of a special event where um, at the elementary age they can shop with their um, favorite teacher. And we do it on a Saturday. It is such a beautiful reminder of how um, I think on a daily basis we forget how hard it is if you're living in poverty or you've uh, your generational poverty. It's just a set of pajamas. Those are seven dollars, eight dollars at Walmart, but that radically made a difference. Um, this isn't a job for me. Like I love, love, love what I do. I loved what I did at camp, and I'm so blessed that this is this is my world.